Hey everybody, welcome to this short demo. Today I'm going to be showing you how to use a keynote presentation natively in mm -hmm. Now, if you don't know what mm -hmm is, um, I would suggest you head over to YouTube and look for a video by this gentleman who is the CEO of mm -hmm, Phil Living. Phil does a great demo of all the features and functions of, of this product or this beta product and uh, will give you a much better demonstration than I can. But what I'm going to show you today is what exactly is going on in the background here. I have a keynote presentation that is running live in a window and I can move, I can use all the animations, I can use all the built-in functions of Keynote natively. So just so that you know what I'm using, I'm running this on a Mac using 10.15, so Mac OS Catalina, and I'm using the very latest version of Keynote, 10.1. 10 10 10.1 has a brand new feature in it called Play in a Window. This allows you to present your Keynote presentation within a window, and that is key to making this work. So let's offer up a quick prayer to the demo gods and I'll show you how this works. So I've jumped out to my desktop so you can see the mm -hmm interface. Now you'll see down here in the palette I have two pieces of content. One is just a picture of a rocket landing on a barge because that's a normal thing that happens these days. Uh, the other is my keynote presentation and just as I did before I can step through the keynote presentation with all of its animations and builds. In fact let me uh, get myself out of the way of that so you can see Phil in all of his uh, his greatness presenting his product. Now, the way that I've done this is that I've got a keynote presentation running in a window. So let me drag that onto my desktop so you can actually see this. I'll press escape to go back to the interface and you'll see up here I have a button that says play in a window. Now this is not there by default. You'll need to go into your settings of your toolbar by right clicking and saying customize toolbar and add the button to play in a window. Once that's running, click play in a window, drag it off onto my second monitor, and now I have a presentation that I can actually select. Now, let me delete it and show you how you set this up. I'm gonna go in here to this little button on the left-hand side, I'm gonna say add a screen share. Remember, add screen share, not add media. Then I'm gonna select the window that Keynote is running in. In this case, the mm -hmm and Keynote, which is the name of my presentation. And now when I select it, it appears in the window and I can step through the slides with all of the animations and builds and everything that is built into Keynote. So as you can see, really simple to do, no need to export your presentations, no need to do anything crazy, just bring it into Keynote, uh, run it in a window and then bring it into mm -hmm. So that's it for this short video. A big thanks to Phil and the team for making mm -hmm such a great product, well, a beta product. If you want to know more, Go look them up on the internet. Go watch Phil's great videos on YouTube. Uh, you'll find out an awful lot more about the product from there. I hope you found this useful. Uh, one of the things that I have been doing during this presentation is driving the whole thing from my Elgato Stream Deck. If you want to know how to do that, tune in for the next video. Thanks, and I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.